Hello there, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stocks Watch Review in the Market. Interesting now, the market's falling the last couple of days. Hmm, so we'll see. We'll see where we go from here because uh, people may try to buy this dip in here and flip it around or may continue following. Remember, earn it's earnings season. BA reports next week, July 24th. That could affect the market. It could affect the diamonds or the Dow ETF. So we, we don't really know. I think the market is just a leave it be for now because earnings season is taking over and that's going to determine the direction that this market takes. Because if you have big, big movers in the market that are collapsing, then it's going to pull the market down. And I'm not saying the market's down today because of Netflix, but it is part of the reason. Um, so Netflix had earnings last night and gapped down quite large. And then you had the fall off today. So here's Netflix, here's the Qs, here's the SPY. And here's the diamond. So all of these things are falling. Actually, let's look at B right, BA right now. <clears throat> BA, BA. No, this really hasn't gone anywhere far yet. Let's look at this. Anyways, the point I'm trying to make is, yeah, everything's pretty much falling today. Uh, but the point I'm trying to make is that it'll be interesting to see what really happens because you had the big bank earnings this week and some of them did have bullish moves, but they didn't really follow through. Um, and, you know, uh, when you have the banks not showing the kind of strength that I wanted to, it's going to be the hard for the spy to lift around unless you have tech doing it. And again, tech earnings aren't out yet. They had like Amazon, Google, Apple, they haven't reported yet. So Netflix was the one today. The market did gap down, Netflix gapped down. I think there's other reasons this market is falling right now. This market seems tired. I felt that it would drop off at some point, but this really wasn't what I what I was thinking it would do. And I thought also would have a news related gap, which this isn't either. So I'll be just watching selected stocks, stocks probably for the next few weeks, unless I see something that says, oh, this is a good market play. Uh, so really we're still holding the uptrend in the market. I wouldn't go long the market today. I wouldn't short the market today. You could have theoretically shorted the market today into the rally, um, but we didn't do that. And I really didn't care what the market did today, quite frankly. We watched other selective things that would have worked with or without the market, but the market is not something that I wouldn't necessarily go long in here, but I think it's gonna be a tough short. So you gotta watch what's happening here if you're in overnight stuff, particularly if you need the market. And Microsoft is tonight, that's the big one. That's the big end. So we'll see what it does. And if you're interested in more information, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. I teach a class. It's once a month. The class for July is July 27th and 28th. Have a great day, everyone.